When I've been approached a few times about my film and about my teleplay and about the scripts that I've been working on with God's House, people are always thinking they're going to take over my life, and that's not true. Not going to happen. You see, God has a plan for me, and God has a plan for you. And if our job is to work with each other for a short time or a long time, that's up to God, in a way, and somewhat up to you. Can you behave yourself long enough to allow someone the right to thrive, the right to fly, the right to be lifted on God's angel's wings to get out of a situation that in which he could die? You see, most people think that getting out of homelessness is easy, and I might have been able to do that except someone decided to attack me. Someone decided to cross the state line with information that wasn't theirs and ruin my life. And whether that information was false or true, it doesn't matter. But what they've been doing all the time since I've gotten here is interfering with every new relationship that I've made here, and they've been stealing business cards that I earned the right to receive from the person who gave them to me. And that's immoral. Not to mention incredibly illegal, because what that means is they think they have the right to molest me. They think they have the right to put their hands in my pockets. Who the fuck are you to think you have the right to do that? I don't put my motherfucking hands in your pockets. I don't even get into anybody's pockets unless they say, hey, put your hands in my pockets and help me get this shit out of here. And most of us are like that. So who the fuck are you, little black bastard of Satan, to think you have the right to do that? And you're such a coward that you can't even show yourself and say, this is what I do to you. What are you going to do to me? And I'll just laugh at you and go, fuck off. You just prove to God that you don't want anything right in your life to happen for you. You prove to God that all the benefits that you're stealing from my life for you are going to blow up in your face and blow up in front of your family and blow up in front of your friends and blow up in front of society, and that's on you.